Of course, there was no Neymar for Brazil, but his jersey being held with pride by his teammates. Here it goes, 11th minute it begins. Look, we know that Germany's good on set pieces, but you cannot let Thomas Muller just sit all alone there. one nothing Germany. You can see he just goes to the back. Now that Luis misses his mark, and he puts it in. It would be love is happy right there. And this was the beginning of a, just a horrible day for yeah, that Brazil. that touch sets up the opportunity, and it turns into history as Miroslav Klose on the second opportunity right there since World Cup history in Brazil, breaking the record of Brazil's Ronaldo. 16 all-time goals, most in the history of this great competition. 2-0 Germany, and as you guys said in watching, you thought that they were done, Brazil. Berlin, you were not done partying. Here comes the German onslaught. Two minutes later, Michael. Yes, if you see the position of each player perfect, mm. you know, and what a finish from Tony Gross. I mean, he had a fantastic game. Right, left, he was everywhere together. You'll be seeing Lahm. That's why he's important on the on the fullback side because he's always pushing, pushing. And with his technique, he has this eye. Again, Tony Gross pressing 1-2 with Kadira. I mean, that's football. Don't spend any time scurrying for the record books, because there's more coming. It's 4-0 Germany at this point. Really? Close. Gross twice. And stunned Brazilian legends, stunned Brazilian fans. And at a fifth, Ozil finds Kadira. Are you kidding me? 5 nothing Germany. And every time the ball entered that attacking third, Brazilian players were standing around and left looking at each other. It seems like each goal were nicer than the other ones. Again, one, two, empty goal. And Kadira as well. He had this great game. And never an adjustment from, from Big Phil. He could do absolutely nothing. From that first goal on, Brazil had nothing. And then in the second half, when the game's basically over, Brazil got some opportunities, but then Neuer says, okay, I'll get into this game a little bit. I'll say one shot, I'll say two shots. Neuer has been terrific with... Uh... Most matches ending up in clean sheets throughout this World Cup. Nearly had one here. We'll show you what happens at the very end. Still 5 0 at this point. Deeper in the second half. Easy. Look how easy. Look at the space. Oh, Sherlo with the finish. 6 0 Germany. Come on. Nobody on him. Come on. Nobody on him. This was all night. And he'll join Tony Cross with a brace. Two goals here. That was a beautiful one. We've seen the quality we have on the bench as well. You know, the Chile came on already two goals. You know, look this technique with his weak foot. A little bit luck as well, but of course, but uh, what a finish again. And as said during the broadcast by Ian Dark and Steve McManaman, the pride and the desire of Germany to close this out scene in the disappointment from Neuer and the fingers pointed back at Mesut Ozil as Oscar scores the most empty goal you can ever score. 7-1, Germany with an extraordinarily landmark performance on their way to a record 8th World Cup final. They will look to tie Italy as four-time champion. And as if the, the pain of the numbers are not enough, with the 7-1, Germany passed Brazil in all time.